maybe I... Enjoying prom. <gasps> So the Nocturnals full game just came out. If this is anything like the demo was, we are in for a serious treat. For the sake of time, I'm going to show you the very ending cinematic from the demo that leads into the full game. Buckle up, because we're in for a serious ride. What are you, fucking Jason? Yeah, get about me. Run before you get shot. Shoot her, run in the truck. No, I don't want to kill anybody. Maggie, oh, give me that. Don't you dare blast me. I should have fucking took her out. Okay. Maybe reverse this shit. Fuck. Is that gonna happen? It's, okay. It's a similar quick time event. Yes! Brother, this guy's dumb as hell. We out! Come on, wait, do I have to drive? Oh my god. Motherfucker swerving. Don't you dare. Let's go! Right where we left off at the end of the demo. Oh God, that fucked him up. That looks so much worse than it looked earlier. Sun's going down, there's a nocturnal, whatever that is in town. We passed out. We look so rough. Oh shit. We're in a bus? Where am I? You're alive. <gasps> and we're chained up like Sorry a about slave? That. It's just for my own safety, you know? Who's this? Oh, we got- he bandages Wait, up too, okay. You stitched me up? Yeah, sorry. My stitching isn't the best. No, 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 no. You, you saved my life. <laughs> well, you're welcome, I guess. You play Logan Sar, Diego. Sorry, I, think, I already know this character's name, I'm pretty sure. From, uh, the trailer and shit. What is this place? How did you patch me up? So... Where exactly am I? I mean, what is this old rusty thing? It's where I live. Oh, sorry. What? It's fine. It's just an old train carriage. You oh. crashed into the train yard earlier. Oh shit, my truck. How did this all even happen? I need to know I can trust you. Um, well, I was passing through the side, and I stopped at that furniture place to look for fuel. Furniture Valley? Yeah, that's it. Wait, do you know them? Those people there? No, I stay away from that place. There used to be a whole group, but the Nocturnal attacked them a few days ago when I arrived in Ruddleside. I'd be surprised if any of them were still alive. Yeah, there were two of them. They robbed me. As I was trying to drive off, one of them shot my tires out. That's why I crashed. I'm so interested oh, in what- must have blacked out. What the Nocturnal not is. Not a lucky day then. Yeah, you could say that. At least I'm alive, though. Thanks to you. I'm Ted, by the way. I'd shake your hand, but... <laughs> what about the other What's hand? What's stopping you from using your left hand? <laughs> That's not the right way exactly. to do it. <laughs> Just don't try and kill me. That's all I ask. Thanks. Diego. Here nice you go. You, Ted. It's a cool name. Thanks for rescue. Uh, yeah, thanks for rescue. Thanks for looking after me. I wouldn't have been able to do this by myself. I'm amazed you've lasted this long, then. No offense, I don't yeah, think Diego's that cool. You know, I've been looking for a community for a while, but well, I've had no luck. 
Do you know of any around here? With Furniture Valley out the picture, I don't think so. You're actually the first person I've seen in a while. Damn. Can I ask, why do you want to find other people? Strength in numbers, I'm not too ni- it's not too nice to be alone. What, isn't it obvious? There's strength in numbers. It means better defense against nocturnals and raiders. Plus, in a group, people's strengths make up for other people's weaknesses. There's no such thing as strength in numbers when it comes to nocturnals. The only way to survive is to hide from them. Communities just attract attention. I'm not surprised there aren't many left around here. Being alone can get you killed too. I'm still here. Yeah, I might go nuts. <gasps> alone. I, I need to see this thing. Yo. Give us a glimpse. It's gone. Of course. As if this town wasn't bad enough already. It's got a fucking nocturnal. Must have heard your truck crash earlier. I still don't know what I'm gonna do without it. Ain't doing shit, you gotta flip that thing? Is that funny? <laughs> no, no. I was just thinking about how I know where another working car is. Are you being sarcastic? Damn, he's got the keys! Ow. The only place left with cars are communities. I mean, that's where I got my truck from, at least. I thought the rest had rusted away, no? This one was stored indoors, perfect condition, fully fueled up. All it was missing was a battery. Oh, like he's being crushed truck. way too nice to me right Amazing. now. Well, where is it? Hold on, hold on. First, let's make this a deal. If I show you where this car is, then you can drop me outside of Ruddle side, and we can go our separate ways. Deal? Yeah. Sounds good. But you aren't going anywhere in that condition. We'll have to wait a couple of days for your wound to heal properly. Try not to get cabin fever. Fever? Are you sick? I think it would take it a couple of days. I can't tell if you're joking. It's not an actual disease, it's a saying. As in, we'll get sick of each other? Well, I hope not. Oh yeah, he being so, he being too friendly. Right, we need to sleep. I'll stay up a bit in case it comes back. Ted is a nice guy Good though, night, I mean, he doesn't seem threatening, I don't Good think. Good Diego. You got that Justin Bieber vibe. Little time lapse? It is draw Diego. <laughs> that is what I would say. Wow, looks like it's getting better. Ooh, you saw his little happy trail? Three days later. Wakey, wakey. Pick up the Jansport. Yo, the game is crispy. I Listen, I know that this is very, like, the graphics are very low. But it, look at the light beaming through that window. Like, what the fuck? Like, this game is so simple. Like, look at this flat-ass looking guitar. But tell me it doesn't look good. Still haven't heard him play guitar yet. We may never, dude. Got a little rust hole here. Got here. Lord of the, Lord of the Flies. That's a real title. That's a real book. The end of the dinosaurs. This is letter two out of six found. 65 million years ago, dinosaurs ruled the earth one day out of nowhere. <clears throat> a massive asteroid bigger than a city crashed onto the planet. Boom. The impact caused huge fires and set tons of dust and ash into the sky, blocking out the sun. Without the sunlight, plants couldn't grow, and soon the dinosaurs had nothing to eat. This chilly, dark period is called an impact winter. Scientists think this is what killed the dinosaurs. We all knew that already. I didn't really need to read that, huh? Oh, yeah, he did draw. Wait, this is the this, wait. This is the fucking hoodie I have on. 
So I drew me? Interesting, interesting. We got here. I've had that t-shirt for years. And, I go on Ice City now. And guess where it's going down? Fucking Goodwill. Anything else in here? Hey, it's in a bad spot. You got one, two, three, four, five, six. Six beds for the homies. And maybe some ladies, you know, if we find any. Enjoy hey, what's up, Diego? I'm starting to think you died of your injuries. Hey, I've had an exhausting last few days. Oh, of course. Sitting around in a train carriage all day can be so tiring. Hmm. My wound's getting a lot better. Good. No fever or anything? Nope. Just cabin fever. You gotta shave that happy trail. <laughs> so, what are you up to here, then? Making a fire pit. We need to eat before we head out. Wait, we're leaving today? I could use a couple more days still. We have no choice. Pussy! The has been here twice Sorry. in three days now. Oh, what the fuck? Is it a big chicken? We can't stay in Rodolfside. It's not safe. <laughs> you see those marks? Okay. One of us needs to gather logs. The other should look for food. Take your pick. Gather logs, look for food. Um, I kind of want to look for food. That sounds... I'll search the forest for food. You'll be oh, okay? Go hunting? With your wound? Well, if we're leaving today, I'm going to have to walk sooner or later. Hey, you know which berries are poisonous and which are safe, yeah? I was looking for yes. a deer, dog. Actually, personally, I don't. <clears throat> okay. What is that moving? Let's see what I can find. Wait, is this like free free? Oh, it's a crow, dude. What the fuck was that? Oh my god, buddy. Poor bird. Looks like poor his bird. Broken. Which one? Mm -hmm. He's faking yeah, it. Maybe enough food for the pair of us. It's a paid actor. I could shoot the motherfucker. His wing's broken. He can't fly. <laughs> Hello? The fuck? Go back to the train. Damn. Are you allowed to eat? Are you? Are crows good food? I will do that. Right, I think I'm done. I'm back. Look what I got. He looks... He um, looks like he's had a night. A bird? Why are you making that face? It's food. <sighs> Come on, let's eat. Oh, fuck! I shot the gun! I hope that people didn't hear that shit. I might have just fucked up. We just let on fire a tampon. This flammable. Well, it's not the worst thing I've ever eaten. Go on. What was the worst thing? I ate a meerkat once. A meerkat? A meerkat? Where are those it's even like from? a type of mongoose found in- No, I know what meerkat is, which makes me think you don't. It can't have been a meerkat, there aren't any native to these parts. Didn't I tell you that I grew up in a zoo? I thought it was a metaphor. No, I told you. I grew up in an abandoned zoo. That's kind of cool. Yeah, it still had meerkats and- Oh, and it had a gibbon named Lulu. How Where's did a, a monkey survive all this time? Monkey? Gibbons are apes, actually. Make a joke. I'll make a joke. Well, I just slept in trees and ate bananas. <laughs> okay. You ready to head out? Yeah. I think so. Wait. Are you leaving all your stuff behind? Yeah, it's just stuff. None of it's worth my life. Except my guitar, of course. Hey, you still haven't played anything for me, you know. <laughs> no, People definitely like rob your ass for a guitar. Come on. In the apocalypse. I've never heard someone play guitar before. Seriously? Maybe I'll play you something once we're out of Rodalside. Really? That's if we make it. We still need to get there before sunset. Come on, let's go. Okay. So, where are we going then? To the high school. 
That was kind of cool. Cars. Lead the way. Here, take this. Flashlight. Wait. Perfect. We're going down here. Isn't that the kind of place nocturnals live? Trust me, it's the fastest way to the school. We'll be fine. That wasn't what I asked. He's just he's just fucking skimming over what I just asked. Hey, now the game's far ahead. gonna get interesting. I don't want you getting lost down here. You mean you don't want to get lost down here? Oh, don't worry about me. I think I know what I'm doing. No, I believe you. You seem to have made it this far. This is exactly the kind of place a McTurner would live. It's sheltered from sunlight and... Hey, why don't we talk about something else? Like, how are you finding that Boss Wygo hoodie? Does it fit okay? Yeah, it's great. Especially since nights are getting colder now. What does Boss Wygo mean? Can we go anyway? opposite ways? It's the name of the bad. town I grew up in. Wait, he'll keep going. How do I think about it? You haven't really mentioned anything about your past. Ted? I don't really want to talk about it. We'll be, we'll be. It's okay, I get it. We've all got bad memories. Wait, wait, I want to go down this way. Come on, nothing. This way. Bad. God. I wasn't. What are you doing? Maybe I won't, maybe I won't. Are you sure? What were those handcuffs back at the train carriage about then? Not for anything other than protecting myself from strangers. If you say so. <laughs> right, enough now. Icky shit. What the fuck is that? Oh, the tracks end? Take us down the wrong way, dickhead. Why is there water in here? Surface exit. Part of me wants to get in the water. Oh, you can't. It's just up this ladder, come on. Sorry, Char. Was in a hurry to go home and watch the rocket. Left the rope in the maintenance room, Oliver. Surface exits. Maintenance room to the right. What the fuck? Wait, what the fuck? Oh, shit. That was so loud. Oops. Okay, um, surely there's got to be something you can use. Yeah, yeah, exactly, it's fine. There'll be, there'll be something. Okay. Oh, oh, so it's the other tunnel. Fuck. Gotcha. Be careful. Loud and clear. I don't know anything about the creature that they keep calling a nocturnal. Can it see me? Does it only see, is it blind? Does it only hear things? Do I need to turn this flashlight off at some point? Or we'll find out. God. What the fuck even was that? Dude, I didn't see anything. I'm just gonna go back to Diego. Everything's fine. Just a little quick peek. There's a door. And that's blood. Oh, I gotta check it out. I gotta check it out. There's fucking bones too. Sure, nothing bad's back here. There's shoes and blood and skulls and hands and shit. Okay. It's been a month without sunlight. The sky is dark and it's so, so cold. I can't go on anymore. 
One of them got me and I'm bleeding. I saw it split all over or spit all over Charlie and her face melted off. It came off in her hands like fucking melted cheese. What the fuck are these things? I thought it would be better away from the craters, but it's just as bad. I can't believe I'm going to die. There's no, there's so many things I wanted to do. Oh, it doesn't let me go back there. Or open that door. It melted off her face like fucking cheese. That is exactly what I wanted to hear. Shit. There's no jump button! Oh my god! Fucking run! Get off the tracks. Fuck that noise. Oh god, the chills I just got. My stamina's not running out. Oh my god, something's back there! Oh my god! Oh. Dude, that was sick. I wanted to get a fucking good look at it though, fuck. I'm so far ahead of it. Bro, you're Perfect hanging ticket. there? There's one down here. It's low key strong. Okay, come on, quick. Yes, a nocturnal. Climb it, climb it, climb it, climb it. Grab it. No, my guitar. I'm gonna grab it. I'm gonna grab it. I'm that. I'm that guy. I'm gonna grab it. I'm gonna Leave grab it. it. Let's go. I'm gonna grab it. I'm gonna grab it. Save Victor. Hurry you the fuck up. Shit. No, Ted. What are you doing? Bitch. What you happen? Get up there, get up there quick. No. Why do we not keep a rope? Oh my god. You are now leaving Ruddleside. Wait, they just showed the fucking moon at the top of that. Am I crazy? Oh, wait, maybe it was just the crack. It was the crack of the, the manhole opened. Ted, you saved my guitar. You say, you, you know, you kind of saved my life. I returned the favor, baby. That's insane. You shouldn't risk your life for something like that. You should fucking you know keep your shit you'd be tied grateful. to you better. Of course I am. Thank you. But that wasn't smart of you, Ted. Look, what's important is we survived. You didn't know that I died hey, once on. before. Go. And uh, that's good. The school's just up this road. That way? Let me let me go back here a little bit. I see a police cop. Fuck, they won't let me. I'll follow you, Diego. Lil D. <laughs> Military hey, roadblock. Is Rottle side near any craters? No, no. The nearest impact site's like hundreds Another of miles letter. away. Yeah, I thought so. There's too many trees and the buildings here are too intact. I wonder why the military came through here then. They probably came through every town when it all started. But whatever they were trying to accomplish, they obviously didn't get very far. I only sort of skimmed through that. Didn't seem that important. Got the high school that way. Yo, soccer field. Let's go. To James, as soon as they started burning up in the sun, I came back here. Back to where you asked me to be your girl or to be your girlfriend. I wanted to leave you a note in case you ever came back to find me too. I will always love you, James, and I'll never stop looking for you. If you ever find this, come find me at your yard. I miss you so much. Love Jordan. Your yard. Ruddleside Ravens. Private playing field.
I'm getting better at remembering with these decision-based games. There's like exploring, which a lot of times I don't do, but I kind of want to take advantage of it if, if possible. Some cool shit you can find. See? I told you I knew where I was going. <clears throat> you were right. What can I say? Look at them little tires. Little discs. Wait. Oh shit. Look at those. Somebody's old pair of glasses. Wanna try them on? No. What? We're gonna go, buddy. Sun's already gonna be down. I don't need glasses. As much as I would love to do that, I'd rather get inside the high school before it gets dark. Let's put them in your backpack. You know, what with the uh, nocturnal almost killing us and all? Yeah, you're right. You sure you just aren't scared of finding I thought he was about glasses? to stomp him. Oh, I already know that. I mean, the amount of times that I... Ugh, what's that smell? <gasps> Damn, that's... Maybe fresh? We found who owned the glasses. Flies are there. I never noticed him before. Ugh, how long has he been here? He definitely has a melted skull. I don't think I'm ever going to get used to it. That's probably a good thing. Come on, let's go. <coughs> Damn! Damn! I'm always falling into places, I swear. Oh, fucking klutz. It's all no, it's all no. What's it say? Wow. Vote it's Lydia like as prom queen. Or er, Lydia, I guess yeah. No one's been here since the impact. Yo, his mouth Explains is moving now. On the mirror. It just looks clean. Like, I don't even know what to say. Like, that could even be a fucking. No? Probably don't know because I didn't finish the sentence. That could maybe be a thumbnail, baby. Senior prom. That's a dope little. Poster. Vote for Rocket King and Queen. Meteor Dance. What kind of fucking window? D Diego, chill, buddy. Play some tunes on that shit while I while I adventure. Ted. Well, it's in like perfect condition. Take it the dance in or the prom did not understand. have. It. What is this? I thought school was supposed to be boring. It's called a prom. They have them at the end of their school year. To celebrate their release? <laughs> yes, Something exactly. Like that. Exactly that. My parents met at their prom. They always talked about it. Oh, so I these. I know who my parents were. Wait, that makes People sense. Died when I was a baby. That makes a lot of sense. Who raised you then? The people at the zoo. Yeah, and they were only teenagers at the time. I don't know how we made it so long. Eventually, someone found us, and I ended up in a post-military commune after that. It's where I learned how to read, shoot, drive, and that's where you stole the truck from. No, I, I didn't steal it, Diego. That whole place got overrun with raiders and I barely escaped with my life. Surprised you managed all that, if I'm honest. The car's just down here. So, Ted said, our character said, his parents... So weird to think they said... Had him when they were teenagers. If only they knew what was coming. I don't know if he meant that they were also at the zoo. I don't know how long Ted has... Because he didn't even know about school. Like, this kind of school. He was born in the zoo. But were his parents also? I doubt it, because this shit doesn't look that old. Might be the smallest fucking school room I've ever seen. 
Ruddle side high school premises map. I think we entered there. There's the stairs. We're here now. It's a kitchen. Garage, maintenance. Damn, you can't even go up here? Come on, devs. Smoking monkeys. Live at the old bakery. 7 p.m. to 29. Lord of the Flies again. That must be one of their favorite books. To Sean, I figured out how to change the door lock so we can have some alone time during prom. Oh, shit. It's my table number and yours. Door lock, my table number and yours. Sean and Haiti. Sean and Haiti. Is that what it said? Sean and Haiti, yep. See? I, I probably could have just left without that. Uh, let's look at this. Sean in Haiti. Sean? Okay. We got one. Let's see. You say three? One. It says one. Haiti. It's Haiti yet. Haiti. Will. Max. Haiti. Haiti, Haiti is five. Sean's one. One second, Diego. Important business. Wait, the fuck? Oh, I can't do it yet? You're tripping. You're tripping. Alright, we'll come back for that, I guess. Adorable, isn't it? What so the little. fuck? You're little. Chill Are on the floor. I don't we'll need to do that crazy. right now. You don't mind? Mm, I'm still recovering from my cabin fever. What the fuck? We should leave in the morning when it's light. We don't want a nocturnal coming after us. Please let me go open that door, though. Our only problem now is this shuttered door needs power. Oh. Okay, well, we've got all night, so don't worry. I still need to put the battery in, so while I work on that, why don't you try and get the school's power back on? I'll have a look around and see what I can find. Already on it. I'm him. Already on it. Oh, we might have to do this, huh? Okay. Save that. Let me go do this first. All right. Of course. Um, Another door code. Wait, 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 wait. I figured out how to change the door lock so we could have some alone time. Yeah, yeah. It's my table number and yours. So is it... Hers was five and his was one. Is that zero five? Or just five... Zero, five, zero. Oh, oh, let's go. The only other way it could have been. I don't know why I got that hyped. <laughs> <sighs> Just as I expected. Nothing happens. Uh, backup fuel. There was a bunch of gasoline tanks in here. Fuel tank, whatever you call these. Oh, I can look in there now. What the hell? How actually did it? We're back in business. This place is probably lit up like a glow stick right now. <laughs> Sorry for my nasally voice today, guys. I'm getting over a cold. Had to get this video out for you guys, though. So... What's the plan once we get out of this town? All I care about is getting as far away from Riddleside as I can. Maybe somewhere warmer. Yeah, definitely. My ears get really sore when it's cold. Oh. What? No, nothing. <sighs> Do you think things will ever go back to how they were? Like, See, his ears get really sore when it's cold? Hmm. I don't think it can ever be the same. Why not? 
with the Nocturnals dying out, surely what's left of the world can rebuild. You gotta That's be optimistic. what's left of the world would want to. You think they wouldn't? The people who would have wanted to would never have survived this long. Well, I did. Barely. Guys? Why are we sitting so close? I've never killed anyone, you know. Okay, I've known this guy for four days. I'm worried I might have to once we're out of Ruddleside. Oh. People are trying to kill each other inside Ruddleside too. Remember what happened to me at the furniture store? Yeah, but you didn't kill anybody. And you got away okay. Have you ever killed anyone before? Yeah, but only people who were bad. How do you decide who's bad? Well, the people who attacked my zoo were bad. Killed this one bitch children. in the demo. Okay, yeah, that- Blasted her head off. That's bad. I guess it's something I'll have to face sooner or later. What with the world like it is? We should sleep. Oh, like okay. You. Okay. Good night, Ted. I understand why I've been feeling some tension. Diego? I wonder what the, it wanted me to use that for. Say fuck fixing the power. Look at this little ass car, dude. Why did we? Why did I sleep out here? Well, I guess that was just a little power now. Can't look in there now. Wait, he's playing a guitar. You hear that shit? Is that him? Principal Mulligan, I am writing this letter to inform you that I will not be attending the prom tonight. I understand that you are short on facility or faculty, and many have already booked the night off to watch the rocket launch. But I can't just, but I just can't shake the thought that something is going to go wrong, and I would like to be with my family during this time. I know on the news they said something can go wrong, or nothing can go wrong, but that doesn't reassure me. It's like they're not allowed to talk about what happens if the mission fails and the meteor still hits us. I'm not one to believe in conspiracy theories, but it makes sense. They're trying to keep us calm. I apologize once again for my absence, and I'm sure you'll be making fun of me once it's over. Mr. Jeffrey, or Mrs. Jeffrey. There he is. Oh, this is... You changed the lights in here, bro? Hey, not fair. I didn't know you were listening. I wasn't playing my best. Well, it sounded good to me. Then again, it's echoing through the whole school. I mean, I've never heard someone play guitar, so... You could be rubbish. Hmm. Thanks. So... What are you doing here? Couldn't sleep. How come? Just thinking about stuff. What stuff? I'm good at stuff. Well, you got me thinking earlier, talking about our plans. I'm just... I'm just worried you're thinking about them as our plans. As in, together. So oh, you don't fuck with me no more? You want us to go our separate ways? I just have this memory screaming at me from the back of my head whenever I picture us leaving together. I know you think surviving together out there would make things easier, but I've done this all before. What happened, Diego? I was traveling with the only person I've ever really cared about. We chose to leave Bos Vigo so we could start a new life somewhere else, just us. I was so naive back then, I thought our plan was perfect. When I woke up the next day, I found out it was only my plan. Uh, Theirs was to abandon me with all our belongings and leave me for dead. Damn. It almost was. My 16-year-old self was out in the world with absolutely nothing except a knife in the back. I never want to feel that way again, Ted. 
And metaphorically speaking? I just think, if we see our goodbyes outside of Rotoside, then we can at least end it on a nice note, you know? I don't want to let my past interfere. You trying to get fucking married, brother? Like, what, this ain't that serious. Um. Yeah, Ted Diego, wouldn't do that. I wouldn't do that to you. I'm not them. You're missing the point. What if something else happened? I wouldn't... I couldn't see anything bad happen to you. Wouldn't you rather have the chance for something bad to not happen to me than to not even have an opportunity to save me? What are you doing? Be there in any well, look, fashion. If we're gonna say goodbye, then let's at least have a goodbye dance. What? It's like prom, you know? <sighs> hey, get up, come on. What is this music? Look. <laughs> Yo. Yo. This right. I think this is how they used to do it. Okay, ready? Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> My God, Diego is a fucking short stack. Hey, I'm gonna miss you. I'm sorry. You probably hate me, don't you? Of course not. Don't be silly. You're my favorite person I know. I'm the only person. <laughs> yeah, know. what the fuck? Even if I knew a thousand people, I'm sure you'd still be my favorite. <sighs> Maybe I... Enjoying prom? Yo, I fuck. should've killed her in this! Ted, what's <laughs> going on? <laughs> you bitch! I'm finishing what Mia couldn't. But the truck is destroyed. No thanks to you two. Don't play dumb. I already found the car down the hall. That's my ticket out of here. Oh, fuck! Guys, I'm sure we can all fit. No! no. I've already tried that shit with her. Tried to sit on her lap and she giggled and said dumbass to me. You can go fuck yourself. What happened to Mia? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mia's not going with you. What happened to her? She was How the good one. How of you to ask. Mia wasn't strong enough to do what had to be done. She left because of what you forced me to do. What did he even do to she you? She left. He threatened us with a gun. Said he was going to blow my fucking head off. Time to see how he likes it. You started it. <gasps> <gasps> yo! Yo! <sighs> Come on, quick. We gotta go. We gotta go quicker. Quicker than quick. Yo! Ted, quick! Help me You are not holding that back, buddy. Diego, you're fucking 5'3", buddy. 120. Wet. I'll find us a way out of here. Oh my god, oh my god. The cr you're, are you telling me the creature is shrumming strings right now? Oh, he's at the prom. Wait. Diego said deuces. Roll to the vent. Brother. Brother, this is straight out of Jurassic Park. Bro, I thought I was just gonna distract him with the little crunch. Oh my god. Can't go that way. There's glass. I think we just have to quickly, quickly get to this. Quickly. Look at him. Look at him. Ooh. You stink. Oh, that's gonna hurt. That's gonna have to make a sound. This shit, this scene right here is straight up inspired by... Oh my god! This shit is straight up inspired by Jurassic Park. I don't know if I've already said that. Oh 
go. Escape, escape. Yo, you know we love the vents. The vents are fire. Holy shit. He's gonna grab this car and skip it like a rock. Look at it. <laughs> just, took, just took maybe the most fire screenshot. No, back here. So she said, I forget her name, Allie, Abby, whatever her name was. She couldn't be strong enough and she left or something. That boy is one hand in it. In the apocalypse, that might be the hardest thing I've ever seen. Bresco, 10 miles. Is it 10? 30? 10? Something like that. I can't believe we actually made it. We're out of Ruddleside. I don't think we'd ever get this far. So, does this mean are we still gonna go our separate ways? Diego, you know you want me, brother. I really do like you, Ted. Full, full homo, you're brother. Sweet and kind, and you've made me feel things again. I forgot I wanted to. YouTube, I love all people. So you'll come with me. Find what's find happening. A community. Or love what's happening. Just <laughs> find a house in the middle of nowhere, and I can't. I'm sorry. That's... Yeah, that's okay. Just... Why? <sighs> I appreciate that you saved my guitar, but that could have gotten you killed. We're when still talking about, about that? Past, I feel like you didn't understand. I gave you it space, bitch! I think you gonna abandon me. I just think you're gonna get yourself killed. Oh, what makes you think that? Us running from How that fucking demon? How can I believe demon? in myself if, if you don't even believe in me? <sighs> Again, guys, we are four days into what if knowing one I another. I come with you, just until we find a community, somewhere that I know you'll be safe, and then we can see what happens. Really? Sure, and it gives you time to teach me how to drive. So there is something I'm good at. Well, come on then. Show me how it's done. So, you start by turning the key. Yeah, I figured that part. Okay then. Oh shit, now look at the distance. The clutch. I don't even see that. Uh, which one's that? Huh. I would have thought you figured that one out. Okay, okay, I'll be quiet. Good. This ain't the end of the game, right? Well. You can talk a little. <laughs> Please don't. They start the music. Please don't. Competent, warm, incompetent, cold. I'm just warm. <laughs> Damn, is that the game? What a shame. That's really, that's, I really wanted more of that. I can't lie to y'all. Damn. If you guys enjoyed that game. Wait, continue. Endings unlocked. Wait, there's a bunch of them? Do I want to do all that though? So my final thoughts on Nocturnals, the full game, very beautiful, love the art style. The game was cut a little short at the end, I can't lie to you. Um, I would have loved to explore more of the game because I think it's that beautiful. And the story is, is extremely well done. Um, but shout out to the two devs who made this, you guys, you guys killed it. Um, I would love to see more from you guys with this story specifically or maybe some more stuff in the future. But. Um, if you guys enjoyed this, please drop a like, 
to tell the algorithm to push this video. YouTube has not been very nice to me recently. But uh, yeah, see you guys in the next one. Peace.